Hey guys, it is just Warren here, and uh, this is going to be my review of Fate of the Furious. This is the eighth Fast and Furious movie. Uh, this one, this one caught me by surprise. It, I was not expecting this much action to be shown on screen. Like, I could barely speak right now. I could barely speak right now. Because it is just action-packed from the start to the finish line. And I use that term loosely because we're talking about a movie with race cars. Um, it, it's very good. It it definitely, it definitely gets you pumped up. If you're not a fan of the Fast and Furious movies anymore, but you've seen one through seven, and you you just think that those movies aren't for me anymore, give this one a try, and you might actually get back into it because there's this really really good Prison Break sequence in the movie that just wow, wow, amazing. It's everything I wanted it to be. It's everything I wanted it to be. What what I expected it to be going in was what I expected it to be going in. And excuse, you'll have to excuse the stain on my shirt because I I ate some M and M's in the movie and. Uh, Now it's on my shirt collar, so you'll have to excuse that. But this movie is definitely one hell of a ride because it's just you don't expect it. You don't expect things to happen. I mean, you kind of do, but you don't. It just leaves you with suspense. And this is a very fast-paced movie, too. This, this movie was just brilliant in every way, even though without Paul Walker, may he rest in peace, it, it wasn't the same without him, it, it was, it was, it was very good though, and, uh, definitely go check this one out, and, and if you, and if you won't, go do it for Paul. Go do it for Paul Walker, guys. I remember reading the news that day and uh, seeing Paul, seeing the words "Paul Walker killed car, killed in car crash," and I remember crying. So uh, go see it for him. It would mean a lot to him, and. Uh, Yeah. If you won't believe me, go see it for him. Yep. Please. Please. But enough about grieving about Paul Walker because I'm I'm gonna start crying if I keep talking about him. Um it was a very extremely well done movie. Charlie's Th Charlie's Theron was in it, and um, it's just action packed to the point where you can't sit still. You're just like this movie is action packed on so many levels from the cars to to the fights very good fist fighting sequences in here um there there's a little bit of comedy in here there's a if you if you catch the jokes you're you're going to laugh so um definitely go see this one it is worth your time and for for these reasons alone, it gets a solid 10 out of 10. I might get comments 
on YouTube saying that this is pushing the envelope a little bit. But if I could recall, there is a death in here that is just so gruesome to the point where I said this needs to be rated R. <laughs> so definitely check this one out. We're going into the weekend. It's a, it is a good buddy movie. So go with your buds. Go with whoever. It's a good weekend movie if you just want to relieve stress and watch some awesome car chases. And that's all for me. Just Warren out.